Well, I don't know why you're stressing. Our Paul's great with them. And he'll probably take them to the ducks later. He loves them ducks. Ah, the food's done. Mind you, our appointment's at just after ten, so we'll probably be back before dinner time, won't we? And I'll be here for a bit. Is there any of those sausages left in there? See, this is what I mean. You haven't got no time for doing fry-ups with three toddlers around your feet. Well, I'll have toast, then. Gemma, you need to take a breath. Yeah, Ches is right. Why don't you do some of those exercises you learn at antenatal? I've got five kids. When have I got time for breathing? Well, you're bound to be nervous. I'm nervous. But I know the doctor's going to say that Alec can have the op. I just know it. Yeah, me too. I wasn't going to tell you, but after you'd gone to bed, I read your leaves. Right, so that's why we've run out of bags. Anyway, I saw a clover right at the top of the cup, and that, that is a good sign, that is. You see? We've finished all our assessments, and Alice scans suggest there wouldn't be any surgical complications, so as far as we're concerned, he's an ideal candidate for cochlear implants. That's great. Yeah, it's amazing. So, when do you think you'll be able to do it? Yeah. I know it's been difficult in hospitals recently because of COVID. I'll ask my secretary to look into possible dates. In the meantime, the two of you go away, have a chat. We definitely want him to have it. Good. Well, if you have any questions? Jim? But surely he'd be able to hear better than with the hearing aids. It would enhance it, certainly. As I've said before, it isn't a cure for Alid's deafness, but it can, with patience and practice, provide sensitive hearing and give him a greater access to speech. Well, that's all we want. Well, what about the risk of nerve damage or fluid leaking out of the brain? I'm afraid no operation is risk-free, but I can assure you those incidents are extremely rare with this particular procedure. OK? Marvellous. So... We'll be in touch. That's brilliant. Thank you so much, Doctor. <laughs>